So part of my practice, I focus a lot on collections. I get a lot of calls from um, clients asking me um, questions about the collections process. I get phone calls a lot saying, um, you know, I have this dispute with this person and they have threatened to send me to collections. What does that mean? Um, it, it means a couple of different things. First of all, um, in, in order to kind of understand um, what that means, a lot of times a company, when you owe them money and they are um, asking you to pay that money and you fail to do that, um, they will oftentimes send their, give their right to collect that money from you to a collections agency, which essentially means um, they're selling their right to get money from you to somebody else who can then spend the time to um, call you or reach out to you to get that money. Um, collections agencies are sometimes, um, they can be a little overbearing sometimes and hard to deal with. Um, so it's wise to have an attorney to help you out through that process so that you understand what's going on and what will happen um, in the future and um, your options for dealing with it. Um, the, the next step beyond that after kind of a collections agency is, and, and some businesses skip that step and go straight to, they hire a collections law firm. So there, there's kind of a difference there. There's companies that just do collections work and they're not necessarily law firms. But then there's law firms that also do collections work. Um, understanding the difference is important because the, your response to um, the demands and things like that and how you react will, will change depending on who is trying to get the money. Um, but a collections law firm will typically start by sending you a letter giving you a certain amount of time to respond. If you fail to do that, they will file a lawsuit. And it's also important to understand in what stage you're in, um, whether a case has been filed with the courts or not. Sometimes collection firms will serve you a complaint, but that doesn't necessarily mean a, a case has been initiated. Sometimes they give you 10 days to respond to the complaint before they actually file it with the courts. Um, so knowing that um, is important because you can potentially, if you respond quickly enough, you can save yourself from having you know a case out there against you and things like that um, so the bottom line the, the biggest thing to keep in mind is with collections it's important to act fast and it's also important to get the advice of an attorney explain the situation you're in so that you can decide how best to respond to resolve the issues get the debt resolved and make sure that there won't be any um, further negative consequences as a result of you know, maybe missing that bill and having that go to collections.